Here we're being asked to solve triangle ABC if angle A is 45 degrees, angle B is 60 degrees, and side A, the side that is across from angle A, is 14 kilometers. To solve this problem, we'll need to draw a, a diagram. And in this diagram, I'll label sides A, or angles A, B, and C as capital A, capital B, and capital C, and the sides across from each of those angles with a lowercase version of the same letter. When you're asked to solve a triangle, you're being asked to find the measures of all three angles and the lengths of all three sides. In this problem, the given information that I'm provided with is that angle A is 45 degrees, angle B is 60 degrees, and side A is 14 kilometers. I'm left to find the measure of angle C and the length of sides B and C. Finding the measure of angle C is a bit trivial because the measures of the three angles added up in any triangle is 180 degrees. 180 minus 60 minus 45 is 75, so angle C is 75 degrees by subtraction. I'll have to use the law of sines to find side B and side C. It's important to note that to use the law of sines, you need to know at least one angle and the length of the side across from it. And in this problem, I do know angle A is 45 degrees and side A is 14. Remember, the law of sine says that the sine of angle A over side A is equal to the sine of angle B over side B, which is equal to the sine of angle C over side C. Of these three ratios, I'll set two of those equal when finding side B and side C. Let's start by finding side B. Well, again, I do already know angle A is 45 and side A is 14. And that will be part of my equation when I find side B and side C. The sine of 45 over 14 is the sine of angle A over side B. And I can set that equal to the sine of angle B, which is 60 degrees, over the length of side B, which is what I'm trying to find. I set sine of 45 over 14 equal to the sine of angle B, 60 degrees, over the length of side B, which is what I'm trying to find. This is a proportion which can be solved with cross multiplication. In this case, sine of 45 times B is B times the sine of 45, and that's equal to 14 times the sine of 60. I'll isolate B by dividing both sides of the equation by the sine of 60, or I'm sorry, by the sine of 45, divide both sides of the equation by the sine of 45, and that means side B is equal to 14 times the sine of 60 divided by the sine of 45. It's always important to know how precise your answers need to be. In this problem, I will round each of my answers for the lengths of side B and C to one decimal place. Side B is 17.1 kilometers. I'll do a similar process to find the length of side C, a similar process to find the length of side C earlier. I found that angle C was 75 degrees. Using the law of sines, and again starting with the given angle A45 and the given side A14, but this time instead of setting it equal to the sine of B over side B, I'm going to set it equal to the sine of angle C75 over the length of side C, which is the unknown. Cross multiplication gives me C, side C, times the sine of 45 degrees is equal to 14 times the sine of 75. I'll divide both sides of this equation by the sine of 45 degrees, and that means that side C is equal to 14 times the sine of 75 degrees, all divided by, all over, the sine of 45 degrees. Again, rounding to one decimal place, 14 times sine 75, 
over sine 45 is equal to 19.1. In this problem, our units are for length or kilometers. So side C is 19.1 kilometers. In the box, I have solved triangle ABC.